is going on guys we are back again I chose probably the worst week possible to start getting back into YouTube I was extremely busy I had like a lab report I had to study for my physics and calculus exam that was uh, I did like seven hours of studying and then I had to do an online lab and then I had worked a little bit not much but I did work and yeah, I've been extremely busy, but whatever. We're getting it done, I guess. So, uh, this is a new ver- I don't know when this came out. Honestly, I have zero idea. It's, uh, Shimaru. Like, there's the old one from Richard Burton's Rally, which was popular in R-Factor. Uh, this one's different. I don't- I don't know where it came from. I don't know when it was released. But it's a nice new Toge track that, uh... I didn't even know existed, so I guess let's get right into it. So I'll mention I am driving the downside garage KZX. A hundred Cresta, yeah. This is like the full release version. I did a, a video on this thing when I was in like beta. But this is the actual full release version that you can get. And as always, the link the mod and this track will be in the description geez I need to stop talking I'm probably not gonna talk a lot in this video because I need to concentrate a lot on driving here it's pretty technical uh, I didn't even warm up in the oculus either so this, this is kind of weird also you may have noticed my lighting is better. I bought a studio light. Oh, well. See, when you talk and drift at the same time, one one's gonna suffer. So usually when I struggle to talk, I'm focusing more on the driving. But when I crash like that, I'm focusing more on the talking. Anyways, the lighting's better. I've got a, like a studio light. And I also sold my old uh, Nikon DSLR. Bought a Canon SL2, which the whole goal with that is that I can use the uh, Elgato cam link and live stream using it. That'd be nice, but I only have the camera right now because it was almost $700. Cam link is like $130, ridiculously expensive. And then I need, just need to buy a uh, power supply for the camera. My frames are dropping horribly for some reason. Um, yeah, so I'll be able to live stream with an actual like wheel cam. I know it's a little bit overboard. Like I could have just bought a webcam, but I could also use it for recording, or I can just record everything at once and not have to worry about syncing everything together. So it'll save me a bit of time, but. This is probably not going to be for another couple of weeks or so until I can uh, actually utilize my new camera. Uh, my frames are dropping horribly. I don't know what the deal with this. Maybe it's because I'm recording and uh, I have my smoke smoke mod I'm using is probably destroying my frames and uh, I have it on ultra as well. so. I guess I can be expected to lose some frames. Okay. Surprisingly not doing too bad, we just had that one mess up in the very beginning, but right now we're uh, driving pretty well. I feel like I'm using- oh man, the frames. I feel like I'm- oh, okay. Did not realize there was a bump there and it just shot me cross and gave me so much angle. I was not expecting that. Again, I, I'm not very familiar with this track. It's relatively new to me. I did like a couple practice runs right before this to make sure it wasn't just me crashing all the time. But I was actually doing it the uh, going the other direction, so I guess it's my technically first run going this way. Oh, these are some very bad frames. Hopefully it doesn't mess up the recording. I mean, 
my frames could be fine. Like, it could be above 60, but in the Oculus you need 90 FPS, and I, don't, I, I can tell when it drops below that. It was really bad there. Saw a lot of ghosting. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. Need to focus up again. A little sketch. Hellgate tracks like this are always a ton of fun to drive. I just love like the technicality of it. You know, like I hate just driving like very basic, simple tracks because you're just not you're not really pushing anything. All this you can easily make a mistake, which makes it so much more fun. I feel like I'm using a lot of handbrake, but kind of hard to avoid not using the handbrake on this track. Or I guess a road, technically. Really? That's a thing? Oh, I knew I was close to that barrier, but I didn't think I'd catch on the inside like that. That's okay. Keep going. Even though I think this is like the end, maybe? Yeah, it's the end. Of course it is. Oh, sh That is definitely the end, by the way. Alright, now we're starting from the uh, bottom. I think this is the bottom. Or maybe it's the top. I don't know. It's the other direction. That's all you need to know. I'm gonna actually try to do a little better this way. Oh, I just nicked that barrier. Oh, the frames. Oh, it's so bad. I always feel like I knocked the uh, mic out of my face. There isn't really any other better position for it. Oh my god, the frames. Okay. It probably doesn't look bad on the recording, like you don't even notice it, but... When the frames drop below 90 in the Oculus, everything kind of like has this like ghost effect to it. Like as if you see like a... Sh a, like small trail of an object. I don't know if that makes any sense. But it definitely looks like garbage in the Oculus. This is uh, not a bad run so far. I might have just jinxed myself. Okay, nope. Always around those tight corners, my frames just drop. Pick up too much speed. That's a cool corner. Oh no. Okay. Kinda messed me up though. 
Understood. Going. Oh my. Wow. I think we're close to the end here. Spend a lot less time talking and I'm driving a little bit better. Oh, I have also a question for you guys, uh, as you may have noticed, well maybe you didn't, but I don't have a pedal cam. I don't know if it's like worth it to even do that anymore, I mean I think you can see my feet through the wheel cam. I don't know if you guys want that back or not, the mount kind of fell off my sim rig and I just didn't bother to put it back on and I was like, uh, eh, is it worth it to record all that extra footage? So I don't know. Tell me in the comments if you uh, actually want that back or not, or if the wheel cam is uh, good enough where you can see my pedals. I mean, you should be able to see them pretty well on this because the lighting is much better. This has got to be the end here. Yep, that's the end. Okay. I didn't die. Alright, so now that we've made it to the end, you know what that means. This is the end of this video. So, uh, as always, the links to this car and this track are going to be in the description. So if you want to try it out yourself, you can try it out. And, uh... As always, if you want to leave a like, leave a like, and subscribe if you want to subscribe. The, you know, typical YouTube stuff, you know, everybody knows at this point. I'm just talking right now. I don't, I don't know what to say. Anyways, uh, yes, get out of here. Go.